thing that we can all agree on, I think, is the, the people that we grew up with leave impressions that can last a lifetime, right? Well, our first guests explore all of that and a whole lot more in the Hallmark Channel original film, From Friend to Fiance. Please welcome back Ryan Pavey and his co-stars Jocelyn Hudon and Kelly Krueger. Welcome, welcome, guys. Welcome, Ryan. I mean, it's a tough act to follow coming off of puppies like that, but I think I feel like these three guys three can do it. Three puppies. They're as cute as the three I'm puppies. Just there you go. Oh, no. Listen, this movie looks like a lot of fun. You guys all play former classmates, right? Uh, and then uh, flashback, you had some, uh, there's a love triangle now, but flashing back, there's a lot of history that goes on there. Let's start with your character here. Okay. Big Ted. Yes. Who was he? <laughs> Who is he now? Because it's a big difference. Uh, Ted got smaller I see. over time. <laughs> okay. Um, no, I, Ted, was, Ted was the nice, shy guy back in the day. I think he probably had a little bit of a rough time socially um, oh. and, and had a, a best friend who was kind of his safe haven. Goes away for a little while, loses a little bit of weight, gains a little bit of confidence in some business, comes mm. back, engaged to... Sue, that's yeah, right. That's <laughs> <a> Kelly's, <laughs> right Kelly. Kelly's character, Kim, yeah. and I, I feel like, Kelly, your character, Kim, is somebody we probably all went to high school with. Oh, there was yeah. a Kim in every single school. <laughs> there was. I yeah. had a Kim in my, I definitely was not the Kim. Uh, but uh, <laughs> we've all gone to school with Kim. She was, uh, as they like to put it in the movie, uh, the queen of mean. Yeah. Really? Yes. I can't, I mean, I know you a little bit. I yeah. can't imagine that you, that's why you're such a great actress. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's it was fun truth. to play. It was yeah, definitely fun to play. I bet play. it was. Very opposite. Really. Now, Jocelyn, you uh, you play Jess. Yep. Right? And Jess is uh, Big Ted's best friend from back in the day, still best friends. But here's the problem, Deb. Yeah. You see, like, I mean, you know, all of a sudden, Jess has got to plan the wedding. And you, have, you have some issues Yeah, with that. that was surprising when he asked me. Now, <laughs> now talk about the mixed feelings. You. you know, you miss things that are right in front of you sometimes. I know, I know, I know. Come on. I mean, we don't know what happens, but... We don't know what no, happens. But I will say, this Jocelyn slash Jess, it yeah. is a little odd that Ted would ask his best friend from high school to plan the wedding. Yeah, I feel like I haven't seen Kim since high school, mm -hmm. so him being engaged right. to her, and then asking me to plan the wedding was yeah. kind of shocking. But right. there must be some underlying <laughs> feelings there, too, for right. So you know you have to kind of get past that? Is that fair to say? The yes. fact that you might have some feelings for this guy. Maybe. Yeah, I repressed them a lot in the beginning. Okay. Well, okay. You're not doing the greatest job <laughs> showing that in the clip we're about to show. I know. So yeah, Jess is, you're trying, but it's, it's kind of transparent. You're not so happy about Mean Girl potentially marrying Big Ted. Yes, let's take a look. We're old friends. Come here. Old oh. friends. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, um, congratulations. Thank you. Ugh. I never in a million years thought I would ever get married, especially to such a gem as this one. He is a gem. You're too kind. No, we're not. You are a great guy. Back me up here, Jess. What, uh, Ted? Yeah, I mean. Cool. Well, thank you so much for that ringing endorsement. This is being funny. <laughs> Come on, Jess. You know Ted better than anyone here. Yeah, I mean, Ted is everything a girl could want in a partner. Wow. Uh, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if you're into the whole like tall, handsome, uh, smart, funny kind of thing, which I, I don't look for. I'm not. I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm not into it. But um, if you are, then that's good for you. Okay, uh, shall we get started? <laughs> <laughs> you all did such a great job really playing good. that. I mean, if you like that tall, handsome, you know, charming kind of thing, sure, I'm, not I'm, not but, I'm not into that. No. You guys did such a great job. You did such a great job playing that girl that we all know, and oh my goodness, Joss. <laughs> That, that's, um, I mean, it's so awkward that it's palpable. Yeah. yeah. Which is really great. Now, which is a compliment, though. I could yeah. ride that, those coattails through that whole movie. That was, that was my yeah, job. Yeah. <laughs> well, as awkward as that scene may have been, there was nothing awkward about the first time you all met each other because truly, you guys got along like a house on fire from the minute you met on set. Isn't that right? Yeah. yeah. The second we met. Yeah. yeah. It was good. Uh, yeah. yeah. We were like, we, we looked at each other an hour in and we were like, we feel like we've been best friends our entire lives. Wait, wait, no, this is how it oh, happened. Wait. Oh, yes, <laughs> that was super fun. Wait, is that this right is, when you met? This hey, is no, 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 paintball. <laughs> met? Like, what's going on? Oh, you really do get along well. <laughs> Where are you going? Paintball. <laughs> we're going paintballing paintball. with paintball guns that didn't have any paintballs <laughs> no in No paintballs, but. but. But it was still pretty fun. Deb, yeah. fun. Deb, we gotta like up up our friendship right, or something. Did we do like, that? I, I, maybe, you know what I'm saying? Can we go paintballing ever in our 20 year friendship? This weekend, that's what we're gonna do, for sure. I feel I've been outdone. I wanna say, Brian, like, day 
one, I couldn't walk through the grass because I was wearing oh, heels yeah. and we were going to set. And Ryan was like, oh, take them off. Take your shoes off. I'll just carry you. And literally, he just like, picked me up and carried me to set. <laughs> you know, he's impressive. He's done things like that around here he as has. well. Yeah. He yeah. picked yeah. stuff up. True story. Right. Yeah. No, he's, yeah. I mean, he's just that Occasion. guy. He's just that guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, we've <laughs> talked a little bit about um, high school stereotypes. I think we can all kind of figure out which high school stereotype we would fit in. So I'm going to go through. I want to find out where you guys oh, would this fit is in. Gonna be I'm going to guess, though, first, good. Deb. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Uh, Football captain. I knew sure. you were going to do that guy. You're so wrong, though. <laughs> what? Oh, man. I was such a nerd in high school. I was super quiet. I kept myself in a really, really small social circle. It was like me and like two dudes were like my, oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> um, uh, and I had a, uh, I don't know what my hair. No, I love like. your hair. Um, no, I was just, I was really shy. I was very keep to myself. I did a lot of like solo stuff. I went hiking by myself. I went surfing by myself. I did all this like by myself stuff. And I had like two friends that occupied my entire oh, social life. So what that happened? That's pretty much it. You know what? You uh, came out of your shell. I guess. I don't know. I, I uh, have to. <laughs> <laughs> I bet, I bet you were that guy that back me up here that all the girls in high school were like, well, he's so quiet and mysterious. Sensitive. He's the <laughs> sensitive type and you just had no idea. You were walking around oblivious. Gotta ask them, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Jocelyn, I'm gonna go with, for you, let's say, um, say student council president <laughs> or pep squad <laughs> no. Pep squad, uh, no. I, no. First of all, I went to an arts high school, so we had no. <laughs> no pep squad. No. <laughs> Spent the majority of my time doing ballet. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's wow. great. Yeah. yeah. How beautiful. Yeah. Oh Look yeah. There. That. Oh, there you are. Yeah. Showing off. Do you continue? That's amazing. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, that's no wonder your posture is so great. Oh, thank I you. Know. I'm just trying to keep up with Kelly. I know. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> Kelly. Uh, speaking of posture. Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. you look fantastic. Oh, You're married, yeah. pregnant. Yes, me. I, I can't believe we let it get this far before we said anything. I mean, so you thank know. you, Sticks. Oh, congrats. Thank you very much. You look amazing. Uh, coming back to high school stereotypes, I'm going uh, cheerleader. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, so far, we're batting zero. Yeah. No, I know. We're not doing very well. No. Wh where would um, you fit in? I was school? definitely, um, I was part of the popular girl, so who would be the cheerleaders, but I definitely was more of like the theater nerd, outcast, okay. um, more of, um, I was I was more Jess in high school. Huh. Um, I would say that um, I really related to, I feel like I was more the Jess character okay. in high school. Right. A little, yeah, going through some stuff, so a little quieter, but um, but definitely, like, I was definitely always performing and doing, you know, dance shows. I was a hip-hop dancer. You were a hip-hop dancer? I was, yeah. There was hip-hop available at your high school? Well, no. not at my high school. It was something I did um, outside like of school. Like activity? Yeah, oh, at God. my school we I had to do that. Times are changing, times are changing. Yeah. Did you ever use that hip-hop? Uh, I mean, it yeah. must come in handy at parties sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Right? yeah. Hey guys, yeah. for people that are going to see this movie, because I think there's a really great dynamic that we've got going on here. I think it's a very sweet story. What are you hoping that people take away from this? Be honest with yourself. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. Honesty. Oh, Just with life yourself. is short. Yeah. There you, you gotta, go. Life is short. You may not be realize honest what you yourself. have until it's until it's standing right yeah, in front of you. Until it's standing right in front and of you. Might, you might lose it. That's Those right. are words. You didn't know I was going to go there, did you? I got you. I got yeah. deep. Great answers. Get it together. That was awesome. <laughs> also have no. Open, open minds to people boomer. who may change. You know, yeah. 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 The people aren't always who they used to be. They can grow and exactly. change. Exactly. I really do feel like there's a lot to take away from this film. Well, great job. Yeah. Congratulations. It's. I just wish you guys got along a little better and you were more fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know I mean? no, it was hard. It was, it was tough. It was tough for you, I bet. It's yeah. Tough. Well, from friend to fiance, <laughs> as part of Hallmark Channel's annual countdown to summer programming event, don't miss the premiere. It's happening this Saturday, 9, 8 central, and you know we're right here on Hallmark Channel.